Continuing with objective four, we're going to define, pronounce, and spell surgical terms related to the endocrine system. There are only four surgical terms built from word parts and none that are not built from word parts, so this should be pretty easy. Adrenalectomy, excision of one or both adrenal glands. Pancreatectomy, excision of the pancreas. Parathyroidectomy, excision of one or more parathyroid glands. Thyroidectomy, excision of the thyroid gland. So let's go ahead and continue with objective five, define, pronounce, and spell diagnostic terms related to the endocrine system. These are not built from word parts, so there are none that are built from word parts. Hopefully I'm not confusing anybody. So here we have radioactive iodine uptake, nuclear medicine scan that measures thyroid function, particularly when distinguishing different causes of hyperthyroidism. Cess to MIMBY, parathyroid scan, nuclear medicine procedure used to localize hyperactive parathyroid glands, thyroid sonography, ultrasound test of the thyroid gland used to help determine whether a thyroid nodule is likely benign or possibly malignant, including whether it is cystic or solid, fasting blood sugar, blood test to determine the amount of glucose or sugar in the blood after fasting for 8 to 10 hours, elevation may indicate diabetes mellitus, Fine needle aspiration, biopsy technique that uses a narrow hollow needle to obtain tiny amounts of tissue for pathologic examination. Thyroid nodules are frequently biopsied using FNA. Glycosylated hemoglobin, blood test used to diagnose diabetes and monitor its treatment by measuring the amount of glucose or sugar found in hemoglobin in the blood. Thyroid stimulating hormone level, blood test that measures the amount of thyroid stimulating hormone in the blood used to diagnose hypothyroidism and to monitor patients on thyroid replacement therapy. Thyroxine level, blood test that gives the direct measurement of the amount of thyroxine in the patient's blood. A greater than normal amount indicates hyperthyroidism. A less than normal amount indicates hypothyroidism. And that will end this recording.